you work in a large nature reserve that's home to more than a thousand species of animals. At night, you drive through the territory in a jeep to see if everything's okay. Most of the animals are sleeping. Suddenly, you hear the monkeys screaming. They jump from branch to branch. A herd of horses runs out of the forest. They look worried too. You hear many animals crying. Looks like some unknown strange thing has woken up and horrified the whole reserve. You see a flash in the night sky. It's a meteorite, and it's flying right towards you. You get in the car, hit the gas, and drive away as far as possible. The space rock falls right in front of you and throws your vehicle to the side. You pass out. The fallen meteorite emits some strange yellow energy. You're inside an overturned car, unconscious. All the animals have calmed down. Thousands of them silently approach the meteorite. Its energy envelops you and all the animals around. The more energy comes out, the smaller the space stone becomes. By the morning, the meteorite dissolves in the air. It has absorbed the animal powers and passed them on to you. You wake up in the grass near the car, surrounded by several people. These are the reserve employees and some guys in black suits. They study the crater in the ground and ask you what happened. You tell them about the meteorite and they order you to go with them. One of them grabs you tightly by the shoulder. You don't like it and you want to break out. Two men in black are holding you. You get angry and feel your muscles increase and your skin becomes covered with fur. You quickly push the men away and roar. Your nails have turned into claws. You've received a bear's powers. Now you're just as strong and fierce. Agents in black are following you. You run away into the forest. You want to be faster and feel your spine changing its shape. Now you're running very fast on all fours. You've got the power of a cheetah, the fastest animal on earth. You're hiding in the forest. The agents are far behind you. You hear a helicopter from above. It shines a bright spotlight beam. Oh no, they've noticed you. Agents use a megaphone to ask you to stop. But you know what awaits you. Labs, experiments, life in a cage. You've seen a lot of movies about it, so you won't just give up. You run out of the forest. They release darts at you. You quickly run to a large lake and dive inside. Webbing has grown on your arms and legs. Your feet are like flippers. Your legs fuse into one big tail, and you are now a walrus. You quickly swim across the lake and come ashore on the other side. Several cars and motorcycles are circling the lake to catch up with you. There's another forest ahead, but this time it's too dense. There's not enough space to develop great speed, but you can get the strength of a monkey. Your hands get longer and your fingers become stronger. You jump up a tree, climb to the top, and inspect the reserve. You need to go south and get to a small town to eat and drink. After a couple of hours, you reach the reserve's border. Now you have to jump over a high fence. Your legs are getting strong. You jump like a kangaroo, but it's not high enough. You fall to the ground. The helicopter catches up to you. You get lizard powers. You get sticky scales on your palms. You quickly climb the concrete wall and jump to the other side. You find yourself in the tall grass. Agents are coming to you from all sides. You're thinking about a snake. Your arms and legs fuse with your body. Now you can crawl. You pass all the people and find yourself on the road. You see a car in the distance. Raise your hand and ask it to stop. Oh no, it's the agent's vehicle. They surround you. The searchlight from the helicopter is shining right on you. You have nowhere to go. But you don't really have to go. Your clothes tear on your back. Huge wings grow out of your shoulder blades. You rise into the air. It's pretty cold here, but the feathers on your body protect you from the wind. Great, you can fly. It's incredible. Ouch, you feel like someone has pinched you from behind. It's a dart, they got you. You want to sleep and fly down. You make a hard landing near a small wooden house. Agents are running after you. You get the powers of another animal and pass out. People in black are searching the house territory but can't find you. Maybe the dart with the sleeping pill didn't work on you? 
After a few minutes, they leave. Meanwhile, you're sleeping peacefully against the wall of the house. At the last second, you managed to get chameleon powers. You merged with the wall and became invisible. You sleep for a couple more hours. The dawn breaks. A rusty rover pulls into the yard. Some old man and a dog come out of there. It runs up to you and starts licking your face. The old man realizes that there's an invisible person in front of him. You come to your senses and tell the old man what happened to you. He gives you some food and clean clothes. You thank him and go away. Now you need to leave the country as soon as possible. You're thinking of a bat. Your legs become overgrown with wings and webbing. You have fangs. You fly without seeing anything. Your eyesight has gotten worse, but your hearing is just fantastic. You have echolocation power and can emit ultrasounds at a high frequency. Somewhere in the distance, you hear a scream of a familiar person. Oh no, it's that old man. The agents attacked him. You turn around and fly straight to the house. One of the agents sees you. He's screaming in terror. You land and think about a rhino. Your body becomes enormous and your nose gets longer. You accelerate and knock down several agents. Then you turn over their car, run into the house and pull out the old man. He gets on your back as you're now a horse and you ride far away from there. You reach the mountains. The old man looks tired but grateful for the adventure. You can't share his joy because you don't know how it will end. You ask the old man to hide while you distract the pursuers. You're thinking of an animal. Your legs and arms turn into hooves. You're jumping up a cliff like a mountain goat. They can't get you here. But at that moment, the helicopter appears again. The agent is aiming a dart at you. Needles are growing on your back. You've got porcupine powers. You release a couple of needles into the agent. It distracts him for a few minutes. At this moment, a cougar jumps at you out of nowhere. It scratches you with its claws. You think about a lion and get its powers. You get on your back feet and growl loudly. The cougar gets scared and runs away. The helicopter is flying up. You speed up, jump off a cliff, and get the powers of the fastest bird in the world, the peregrine falcon. You dive down at great speed and land in the forest. Now you need to find the old man. You have a nose like a dog. Now you can smell your friend and walk towards him. At this moment, you come up with an excellent plan for how to stop those people in black. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.